so yeah probably last part hai yeah. and this is this will be the last part of scar setup okay before pressing the continue Leave my friends here with you, monster. You're not surviving this. Disappointing. I preferred the optimal solution to this conundrum. One that would benefit all sides. But you leave me no choice. It's only a matter of time before I break the protection my creator granted you. Oh, Let's see how many of your deaths will be required to destroy you permanently. Thank <laughs> you. 
Mission Specialist Kate Ward. The entity known as the Custodian, the one responsible for everything that happened to the SCAR team, has been destroyed. His existence endangered not only members of my team, but potentially all of Earth as well. And who knows how many more worlds. He was a product of recklessness rather than malicious intent. 
but the consequences of his actions were tragic nonetheless. So many lives lost, including our mission commander, Richard Robinson. He will be dearly missed. Naya and her people, creators of this place and of the custodian, were in many ways similar to humans. Scientists, explorers, seekers. They discovered something incredible, something that might hold the secret to all life. Perhaps this was a mystery that was not meant to be unlocked so soon. Their fate should be a warning to us all, but not a deterrent. If anything, I now know that even in the vastness of universe, there are others like us, people looking for answers. That gives me hope and makes the great distance from home just a little smaller. Naya left us her gift, just as she said. The monolith has the coordinates of a planet that I hope supports human life. I believe it to be Naya's homeworld. I don't know what awaits us there. New dangers, new discoveries, perhaps even a means to return to Earth. These are all unknowns. But what is certain is that we stand together. Mike, Tam, and I. We are scientists. We are a team. We are scars. We will find our way home.